today I'm sharing more love for claw clips with half up and updo hairstyles with three different clip sizes, tiny, medium, and large. Hello, this is April with The Curl Story, a channel dedicated to a new chapter of curly hair styling. And the first look is a half up hairstyle with a tiny claw clip. And the trick here is that to do this half up hairstyle, I'm not actually going to clip up half of my hair. So as you can see, I'm just going to take very small sections on either side of my face. So just the hair from my ears forward, I'm going to bring those two sections back and gather them down at the back of my head at eye level. So I'm just going to check in the mirror, make sure my positioning's correct, and that's where I'm going to place the tiny claw clip. I always do have to look in the mirror because when I hold it in that position, it always feels much lower <laughs> than it is. So I always just wanna make sure that I'm getting the right balance of volume with the hair on the top, if I'm getting enough volume at the crown, and then also getting that beautiful cascade of curls at the back. So I like to clip the two sections of hair together first, check the positioning, and then tuck it into the rest of my hair to secure it into place. So if you do have a lot of baby hairs like I do, a great way to help those lay down or actually just tuck into the rest of the curls is you can spray water on your hands, rake that water through, or you can use hairspray or watered down gel to do this. But it, the raking in just allows the curls to settle back into their curl families without having to slick your hair back. So you can still keep that curl volume, that texture, and give your curls however much space they need to thrive and be happy so you can be happy as well and not have to fight against that texture. Okay, next up is the medium claw clip. This is also a half up hairstyle with a couple of different tricks to accommodate the different size of the claw clip. So some claw clips are different weights. Some might be a bit heavy, they might sag on your hair. Others just might have a different shape to them. Some have a curve, some have a flat rectangular shape. So you might want some different ways to be able to style those looks. So for this first trick, I'm going to use a ponytail holder. And you know, to prevent the rest of the curls from trying to get involved with creating this mini ponytail holder, I just used a styling clip to hold down that hair in the bottom so it can stay out of the way. <laughs> So then with this tiny ponytail holder, I'm going to secure again just those two sides of my hair, the same as I did with the first look. But this is going to help prevent sagging. So you can use a little bit larger size claw clip that may be a little bit heavier, or if you just want to put it up a little bit higher towards the crown to show off the design. For the large claw clip half up hairstyle, I'm going to move this gathered ponytail holder back to that eye line level. You can definitely make this top section as tight, as slicked back as you'd like it to be. You can also loosen it up. So let's say at this point I've tightened up my ponytail holder, but then when I turn around and look in the mirror, I can see that it's too tight around my face. I can just pull some of my hair forward to loosen it up and to allow more space and more volume. So you always have options there. Here I'm just using my hand as a guide to position that large claw clip over that gathered mini ponytail to create this large half up hairstyle look. And again, you can change the positioning wherever you'd like. But I also wanted to show you an updo. So let's say you were wearing this half up hairstyle all day, but by the end of the day, you want to put your hair up. All you have to do is move your claw clip so you can keep that mini ponytail holder in place and just twist up your hair and gather it with this large claw clip. 
And of course, depending on the length of your hair, my hair is, is pretty long at the moment, <laughs> but you can definitely have some options to be able to change up your look throughout the day. Now, the last claw clip hairstyle updo is a little bit different and a little bit more unusual. So first you'll need to gather all of your hair up at the crown of your head. Then just twist that high ponytail as if you were going to make a donut bun. But before you twist it all the way around, leave your ends down and secure that middle section with your large claw clip. So you have the bun look at the top, at the crown of your head. From the side view, you have the profile with the design of your claw clip. And then at the bottom, you have your curly ends, your curly fringe to create the finished look. It's super secure. It's a great way to put up your hair without crushing your curls so you can refresh them for another day or for another event. Thanks so much for watching. I hope this was helpful. Please hit that subscribe and I'll see you next time.